A prerequisite for optimization of the native TPA molecule is the knowledge of its functional domains. The active catalytic center is formed by three amino acids, serine, asparagine, and histidine. The two kringles are responsible for binding of TPA to fibrin, especially the lysine binding site at the second kringle. The finger domain enhances fibrin binding. The epidermal growth factor domain and the glycosylation at asparagine 117 are responsible for the binding to liver receptors. TPA is highly bound to liver receptors. Following endocytosis, it is rapidly degraded, resulting in a short half-life of three to five minutes. Through point mutation in position 103, TPA is glycosylated at this site. By point mutation in position 117, the high mannose sugar moiety is removed at this position. These structural changes prevent the binding of the molecule to liver receptors. This leads to a significantly longer half-life of approximately 22 minutes. On the basis of experience with native plasminogen activators, the amino acid sequence 296 to 299, lysine, histidine, and two arginines, was replaced by four alanines. This resulted in an 80-fold increase in Pi-1 resistance, comparable to that seen with the snake plasminogen activator. Designed on the model of Vampire Bat Plasminogen Activator, the fibrin specificity of TNK is 10 times greater than that of native TPA, which results in negligible fibrinogen consumption. Due to the high structural similarities, none of these alterations in the TPA molecule were shown to induce antigenicity.